Hey guys, welcome to the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your NFC reader not working on your iPhone. Now, this may be a software-related issue, and that's what we're going to try to fix here if it's not a hardware issue that you're having. So let's dive right into it. So the first thing is whenever you're having issues, I recommend is taking off any case that you have. Sometimes a case can actually get in the way of the reader interacting. So remove the case. The other thing you want to also ensure that your phone has at least 20% or more charge. We see when the charge is lower than 20%, some of the functionalities are reduced. So you want to make sure at least 20% or more charge on your phone. Now after that, the other thing you also want to ensure when you're trying to interact with the NFS reader is that the phone is open like this so it shouldn't be like password locked or in the lock screen itself you want to make sure that you're accessing the main screen itself and after that I recommend is closing out all the apps that you have open so if you have all the apps that are open you want to slide up with your finger and simply just go ahead and close out the app especially the wallet app as well so you're gonna just go through and swipe up till if you swipe up there is no more apps open as well now after you have done that the next thing you want to do is pull down the top menu here turn it on airplane mode for a brief moment and then turn it back off just like that and what we have done is a quick network refresh which again if you're having connectivity issues that's impacting NFC reader it will resolve that issue now if you're still having an issue the next thing you want to do is a force restart so in order to do a force restart you're going to press volume up and then press volume down one after another and then you're going to hold the side button till the screen goes completely black and the apple logo reappears and then you'll let go of that button which will initiate a full shutdown and then a restart and reloading the code so we'll show you in real time so volume up volume down and then i hold the side button just like that and you're going to want to keep on holding that side button until the screen goes completely black so as you can see it went completely black now wait for the apple logo to reappear and then i'll let go of that button again all it's doing is shutting it down completely and then reloading the software so if there is a software related issue that's impacting that nfc reader it will resolve this now this method that we're doing will not delete any of your personal data so all your photos videos apps will still be there and you shouldn't have any issues with that and hopefully by now your NFC reader uh, is working. Now if you're still having issues the next thing you want to do is a network or reset. So in order to do that so you're going to go into your settings hop over there and then go to general and go all the way down here where it says transfer reset iPhone. You want to click on that the first option for it reset here and then you'll see the option to reset network. Uh, so in order to reset network you'll just click on that it will take about 10 to 15 seconds but what this will do is reset any network settings that you have if you have saved Wi-Fi password any Bluetooth connected devices the BPN related setting will get reset and hopefully also will fix any connectivity issue for your NFC reader so you'll want to apply that after you have done that and it's still not working it's time to make sure that our phone is up to date with the latest software version in order to do that again we're going to be in settings and go to general software update and look to see if there's an update available now if there's an update available it will say here the version number and then download and install you'll click on that but before you do that ensure that you're connected to a good strong wi-fi or cellular data and you have at least 50 percent or more charge and then you're going to want to download and install give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes in order to download and install that update successfully and after that i hope that your nfc reader is working now for some reason it still doesn't work there's a really high good chance that it's most likely the actual hardware that's the issue in that case you'll need to go ahead and um, get it diagnosed at the apple store or in a certified uh, diagnostic place but besides that i hope it is working and if so please make sure the like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time